Hey, how's everyone doing? Eh, I'm just gonna get straight to the point. I'm slowly starting to lose it, man. Uh, being home with nothing to, I'm not gonna say the word nothing to do because there's always something to do, right? There's always books I can read. There's always things that I can do as far as like learning a new skill. I have a lot of things saved up from Udemy, Coursera, Skillshare that I, I wanna work on, but I need, I like, I don't know. It's been like two weeks since shelter in place has taken, I think shelter in place or whatever, shelter at home. And I'm just, it's hard. I don't know how other people are doing right now as far as like staying sane. And I, I, I don't, I don't, I, I never thought I would feel this way. You know what I mean? Like I'm slowly just starting to go I'm starting to feel a little depressed. It's not so much of a depression where like I'm sad, but it's just like, I need, like it's no joke, I need basketball. I need interacting with other people. I just need life. You know what I mean? Like for me, life is about socializing. It's about going out there and venturing new activities, new restaurants, new hikes, new meetups, just, entertainment like we're not meant to just stay home and watch tv and be in front of the computer all day you know what i mean like there's only so much itunes can entertain me there's only so much starcraft i can watch there's only so much anime and video games and simpsons and whatever there's only so much of that i can do before i snap you know like How's it? How how's everyone doing? How are you doing? How 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 is everyone maintaining their sanity throughout all of this? I think it's particularly hard too because I'm alone. You know, my my family's all in LA. At least my mom's got my stepdad. You know, my my siblings have their parents. My dad has his wife, obviously. My other brother has his family. I'm alone here, and that's probably the hardest part. You know, most of my friends have. They're all married, they all have kids. So it's just hard when you're essentially you're single and you have no one to really interact with except for this little one right here, my little dog. But I mean, other than that, that's it, you know? <sighs> and then we just found out today that, you know, May 4th, you know, May the 4th be with you, by the way, is going to be you know, that's when shelter in place in Washington is gonna stand. It's just, so, so it's April, what, 2nd right now? And we have another month left, give or take, to, to deal with this. And I feel like this is now more than ever to realize how, how much grit you have, how much determination, how much persistence, and I guess ultimately willpower, I guess. Willpower, dedication. Uh, what, what's the other word I'm looking for? What's the other word I'm looking for? I guess discipline. Discipline's the other word I'm looking for. To just kind of maintain and try to keep, keep, keep yourself from just losing it. So, I don't know, I just kind of want to share my story. It's, it's a short video. I wasn't planning on making a long talk, but I, I realized like doing these videos is, is a creative outlet for me. And it's something that I really, really need to do. To, to express myself, just kind of make my needs met because, you know, most people have someone to talk to to express their concerns about what's going on with their life. And of course I could easily call my mom, I could call my good friends, but it's not the same, you know, versus having one, someone like really there right next to you just to like say, hey, you know, how are you doing? Like even, you know, Andreas has roommates, good friends have husbands or roommates as well. So, I don't know, I don't know. I got a new origami set that I'm gonna start doing in a little bit, but I wanna still wanna practice my piano and yeah. I mean, the main thing is just trying to stay hopeful. And I realized how much, how much internal strength someone needs to, to really have to really go through this. I mean, I'd say I'm lucky enough that I still have a a job even though referrals have been really really slow at this point i mean next week i'll have like 
four patients. I mean, that sucks, like four patients for the whole week. Rest of the time, I'm just home, you know, lingering in your thoughts, lingering in your just isolation. And yeah, anyways, just hope everyone's doing well. And if you want to talk, if you want to communicate, you want to share just your experience with how you're dealing with isolation, feel free to hit up a comment. We'll have a discussion, we'll talk. You know, if you're feeling lonely out there, just reach out to me and we could perhaps just have some togetherness, you know, some type of connected feeling. So, all right. Thanks for listening and uh, yeah.